Hey guys, Just Jamie here. So excited with my first trip to Trader Joe's. Um, never been there, been in a grocery rut, want to, you know, try something new. Um, stick with the same old, same old. So, um, I drove to Trader Joe's. It's a little ways for me, but so well worth the trip. Um, I see why you Trader Joe people are like we are about our GT. Oh my God. I will make this trip a lot more often. Um, the people there were awesome. Wonderful experience. Like, I'm a customer now. But, all right, let's get straight into what I got. I'm excited to share it with y'all. Um, one of the first things that I did get were these coconut strips. Like, they're like little fries. Like, come on, does it get any better? Coconut french fries? Like, I, I can't wait. I cannot wait. And they're like lightly sweetened. So, I'm going to have to like force myself to like ration. I should have bought a couple of them. Um, I picked up some dry uh, mango slices. My boys, they love mango, but I hate to cut mango. It doesn't store well. Um, by the time we actually use it, it's like super ripe. I just, you know, I'm going to try this and see how this works. Um, I picked up some organic banana chips. This whole bag, it's a pound of banana chips. We're like $3.99. That is not bad at all um, for organic banana chips. Um, yummy. So like I can say, I'm excited about these. Um, we did pick up some of these. We call them fruit leathers at, you know, Trader Joe's. What, what do y'all call them? Fruit wraps. Um, but we picked up some apple, banana, some uh, wild berry and some raspberry, fruit berry. Matter of fact, my younger son was in the back seat and I had to stop him from eating these. We picked up some cocoa baton, uh, batons. A southern folks just deal with this. Um, they're like chocolate little wafers. I think they'll be like awesome, like with coffee or some cocoa. Um, I picked this up to try this. Um, it's a soft pretzel stick. So I, I think it, I thought about maybe like like a bachetta or something with these and giving it a try and see how we like that. Just slicing it, toasting it, you know, little mozzarella, little basil, little tomato. Give that a try. Um, in my house, we call this pirate booty, um, but they call it cheese puffs. Um, so I was excited about trying these these white cheddar puffs so we're gonna give these a try um we got our apples i was really impressed with the price four pounds of apples for 2.99 this won't last long in my house but oops another one bites the dust that's what we say when things fall in our house so i thought that was a really good deal We picked up some organic pears, and this is two pounds, and I think this was like $1.99. Um, they probably need to ripen a little bit more, but hello, $1.99, you can't beat that. Then we got these sandwich cookies with the cookie butter. I read like super rate, you know, reviews on this, so I'm ready to give this a try. Also, I did buy the butter, the cookie butter. I am, okay, so I'm not gonna lie, I researched everything. And every time I would look up Trader Joe's, like people were going crazy about this stuff. So I picked up some of it to try it. So we'll see how this is. Um, of course, I picked up some organic coconut oil that. I, I mean, anybody who's ever tried coconut oil knows that this is a godsend. You can cook with it. You can use it as lotion. You can wax your furniture. You can put it in your hair. You can fix the squeaky door. You can do about any and everything with coconut oil. I picked up some organic pumpkin puree. Um, I have a few pumpkin recipes I want to try out, so I thought that, you know, this would be good for that. I also picked up some vine ripened tomatoes. Don't those look good? Let me just put an up close look at those. Like, oh my God, do those look delicious? We picked up some bananas. 
19 cent a pound and then the guy tells me that you never pay more than a dollar for five bananas like is that not the coolest thing ever so I did pick up some 19 cents bananas um, I picked up some oatmeal and honey soap. My son has eczema really bad, and so I thought I would give this a try. And actually, it's two bars in here, and it was $1.69. So, we're going to see how this goes. And the ingredients are, like, really, really simple, y'all. I mean, nothing crazy. So, we're going to give these a try. I picked up some of these ginger chews it says sweet hot ginger candy with the natural stimulation and, de deli and deliciousness so I wonder how these are they say they're supposed to be good for like like car sickness like upset stomachs and stuff like that so I can't wait to see how this works so I did pick up a pack of those is that not cute look at that little ginger guy sitting there He's just like, buy me, buy me. I also picked up some of this Trader Joe um, Goddess dressing. I mean, just look at that. So I'm excited about that. So I picked up some spinach. And I think I'm going to have a spinach and tomato salad with some Goddess dressing. I am a sucker for salt walks. Salt water taffy. I've already even looked, broke it, so it couldn't wait. Um, I did pick up some of this. Oh my god, it's so good! It has cherry, strawberry, banana, red licorice. I did try the red licorice. It, you can keep that. <laughs> um, sour apple and watermelon. So yummy. All right. So for the frozen stuff, I picked up some edamame I probably said that wrong but oh well I'll just like steam this up with some sea salt my kids will eat this like crazy oh and this look it already has the sea salt in it so see I don't even have to put it in there um, I picked up some hash browns I heard great reviews about some Trader Joe hash browns pick those up um, some chicken fried rice um, it's football season, so I want to find something quick and fast, and like, it's a whole, it's almost a pound and a half. Like, that's a lot, and I want to say this is like $2.99. And then, I also read great reviews about the mac and cheese, so I picked that up. Did I show you everything? So, everything that I showed you... I bought for less than I want to say it was about $65 like that's not really bad a lot of the stuff was just for me to get a feel just to see if I was gonna like this stuff make sure I didn't leave anything else in the bag um, so all I can say if you've never tried Trader Joe's try it out um, if you're like me I can see myself driving up there every month to, to, to buy my Trader Joe's staples so guys that's my Trader Joe's stuff I'll see you later thanks guys